crunch frappuccino, green tea lattes, pumpkin spice latte, ice guava white tea lemonade. These are just some of the amazing drinks that Starbucks has to offer. I know most of you guys get excited for summer and Starbucks releases their new summer drinks, especially in the fall seasons when the pumpkin spice latte gets released and in the Christmas season when you get the peppermint mocha, the gingerbread latte, and the eggnog latte. I mean, come on, all these festive drinks, you can't go wrong. My name is Talon Nakarado, and today I'm going to be talking about why you should purchase Starbucks products. So, they have many creative drinks, there's many benefits and perks of purchasing Starbucks, and just the coffee experience in general. Okay, so here are some of their creative drinks. They have a dragon fruit iced lemonade. I mean, come on, what other cafe has dragon fruit? Or guava white tea lemonade? Their cold foam uh, mocha latte, it is really good with caramel. And even their festive cups during the Christmas season are super nice and attractive. And with their drinks, you can customize to your liking. If you don't like something or you want to add something to it, just tell the barista and they'll gladly make it. As well, they have a secret menu. So if you want to make a Twix Frappuccino, just tell them the ingredients and they'll make it for you. Okay, so what are the benefits and perks of purchasing a Starbucks product? The first thing is the rewards program. The rewards program is probably the best thing that Starbucks has to offer. So you first download the app or you can get a card and you start off as a green member. And then for every dollar spent, you get two stars. Once you reach 300 stars, you become a gold member. These are all like the benefits of becoming a gold member. I've been a gold member since 2015, so I get free refills on drinks and I get a free birthday drink. With the free birthday drink, you can get any size you want, any drink, you can add anything and it's all free. So take advantage and get an expensive drink. As well, it's very convenient to use and it's a lot of loyalty to the program. As well, if you download the app, you can order ahead so you don't have to wait in line. You just, you know, order on your phone and then you go up to the counter and you get your drink. Okay, so Starbucks is also ethically and socially responsible. All their coffee beans are ethically sourced and they practice sustainable practices. Uh, they donate, uh, tree resistance to these farmers so that they don't get threats from coffee lead dust which is like really bad for the farmers and their tea is not factory produced so many of the people that produce the teas have lots of expertise in it and they use proper technology to produce these tea leaves they're socially responsible because they have proper recycling on the cups if you ever looked at like a starbucks cup for example like it usually tells you how to properly recycle it and properly put it in the recycling bin. They want to eliminate all plastic straws by 2020. As you know that plastic straws are super bad for our environment and when they're put into our ocean, they're hurting a lot of the turtles because it goes through their noses and they can't breathe. If you go to Starbucks, they have new lids, especially for like the colder drinks. They kind of look like this and they don't really have straws anymore. And as well, they donate all their unused food to people in need. So by the end of the night, they give it to the less fortunate you don't want to be getting rid of food when it's still good. Okay, so when you go to Starbucks, you have a sense of personal reward. I know when I go to Starbucks, I feel super happy and excited to get my drink. Especially in the morning time when I'm kind of tired, you know, before school, 8 a.m. class. I'll go to Starbucks, get a drink, and I'm ultimately satisfied. Okay, so the atmosphere at Starbucks. The lighting, the aroma, and music make it such an attractive place for customers. I know when I go to Starbucks, I can get much of my studying and homework done because I see many other people studying as well. The ambiance is very attractive and they make it very cozy so people feel like they want to do their work. They're excited. You know, there's not loud people in there. It's a very quiet place. As you can tell, they have like wood in there and the nice coffee beans and the pictures make it very attractive for customers. Okay, so status. So using the marketing of psychogenic theory, we buy Starbucks because it develops a sense of status. Starbucks is a bit more expensive and they have really different drinks and we like to show it off. Most of you guys remember the 2014 basic white girl face from Tumblr. So this is, you know, girls would wear clothes like this, post their frappuccinos on Instagram and then Starbucks would get lots of advertising through it. I even did it when I was in grade seven. 
and using the balance theory. So if a famous person like Ariana Grande was drinking a caramel frappuccino and we liked Ariana Grande, we would buy that too. As you can tell, things like Starbucks influence other people to buy their products based off if a celebrity buys it. Okay, last but not least, we're gonna talk about the amazing quality customer service. They always have a positive attitude and they always ask about your day. I know when I go to Starbucks, I feel super comfortable with the baristas and if I don't like a drink, they're so happy to remake it. They're like, okay, like if you don't like the drink, like it's fine, which I really love. Okay, so before we end off, we're gonna talk about a call to action. So how can you know more about Starbucks? So go on their website, you, they have so much more socially responsible things that they go through, so many more ethical practices. You can look through all their drinks, and if you download the app, you can know seriously all their drinks, I have it. And you can purchase all these products. These are all my Starbucks cups that you guys can use as well. So to finish off, I'm just gonna be talking about my top three favorite drinks from Starbucks that you guys would love. So Cole's Brew, five pumps of vanilla with milk. Five pumps sounds like a lot, but it's really not. It's perfect in the morning, the coffee's fresh, really wakes me up, especially before school. Any of the matcha drinks. Matcha is super underrated, a lot of people don't like it, but green tea matcha is the best. You can get the frappuccino, the latte, or the iced latte, and just add five, five pumps of vanilla to get that extra flavor. And my favorite summer drink is the ice guava white tea lemonade. It's not too sweet and it's not too tarty. It has like kind of like a peachy color to it, as I mentioned in the slide before. Really recommend it. If you have any questions, please tell me now and I'll be gladly to answer them. Talia, how often do you go to Starbucks? I go to Starbucks three times a week, but during the school time, I almost go every day. I mean, I have to get my morning coffee. And I just wanted to say thank you for listening to my presentation. I hope that you guys learned something about Starbucks and that you're gonna purchase their product based on the coffee experience, their creative drinks, and the benefits and perks.